Hey there, fellow summer nurses. No clue, nah, nah, nah. Here coming at you with another crystal opening video from the July 4th event. And in today's video, we're actually going to open up eight Abyss Nexus crystals. And as you guys can see real quick, I do have a total of 10 crystals. But for this video, we're actually going to open up eight crystals. And the reason why is because I actually want to save two of the crystals uh, for the cosmic for um, Adam Warlock uh, when he becomes available and you'll be able to get him in this Nexus crystal. So I'm definitely looking to save for that. Uh, so we'll definitely be opening up one cosmic and two later down the road. But we're going to open up the rest of them. And let's take a quick look. At what you know, what I'm hoping to get out of these crystals, um, definitely hoping for the skill to get a, an awakening of blade. If you guys saw a previous video of mine, you will see that I, I just pulled them, and as you guys can see, Adam Warlock, I don't have him. Um, I know he's available as a five star, but I don't think he's available yet as a six star. So. Also looking to possibly get Sauron, Sandman, Quicksilver. Uh, those are some of the champions that I want to get. And that's why I ended up uh, picking the class that I did for the Nexus Abyss Crystal. I also want to get myself a Gore. I do have the 7 star version. But to get the 6 star version it will be just as cool. Alright guys. So let's get started. Like I said we're going to start off with Cosmic. Only because we only going to open one and save the other two so let's get started and hopefully we could get some nice luck but for this one i am hoping for gore so that's that's that would be a nice pull all right definitely did not get gore out of this but if i'm correct yep we can actually awaken ronin so i think we're gonna go with that uh for now and just awaken him. Um, that means one less champion to use uh, an awakening, awakening gem on. Uh, and he got himself a natural dupe. Alright. Not a great start, but not that bad. Could definitely be a lot worse. Alright, so now let's go on to the next one. Uh, which will be skill. All right, as you guys know, I'm looking to get an awakening of a blade and maybe save myself uh, a gem. So here we go. All right, definitely did not get blade, but I get to awaken Black Panther. So we are two for two when it comes to awakening champions. Can't complain about that at all. Plus it is seven star shards. And I'm trying to get enough shards so that way I can actually open up four crystals for you guys on one of my soon-to-be-released videos. Alright, so as you guys can see, we are definitely getting a lot closer. So next up, if we find the crystals, here we go. Next up will be Mutant. I know I grabbed two of them, but I said, you know, why not? Let's try to see if we can get Sauron, maybe awaken him on the second crystal. That would be some amazing luck, obviously. But here we go. Okay. Uh, this probably is the worst to choose. I mean, really, Beast. Um, I know awakening him would save on an awakening gem eventually. But on an Abyss um, crystal, I really don't want to do that. Um, there are some nice choices. Professor X, Pyramid Storm X, Bishop, very tempting, Colossus, but you know what? I'm going to go with Kitty Pride. She's a rank 4 champion, 26 on her, bring her up to level 60. It's not a bad thing at all. Alright, so let's go with the second crystal. Still hoping to get Sauron, but as you guys can see, I've gotten no new champions yet. And I still don't. Alright. 
So let's take a look and see who we're going to get. At least it's, we don't have to worry about awakening any champion. So it's basically just adding 26 into one of them. So let's see who we choose. I think I'm going to go with Archangel. He is a champion I am looking to eventually bring up to rank 5, which will be great. Um, bringing him into map 8 right now. The um, path that I am assigned, um, I definitely use him. He's definitely putting in work for me. So bringing him up to rank 5 would definitely help with the alliance quest. All right, guys. So now we got four left, which are the science ones. And you guys saw there are a few champions that I want to get. Sandman, Quicksilver. Um, I think there was one more there um, that I wanted to get, but... So far, we haven't gotten any new champions, so, I mean, unless the luck really changes, I'm not expecting much here, but you never know. Maybe we can get really lucky. And here comes Crystal number one. All right, there we go. Um, Yeah, probably going to awaken Spider-Man, even though... 26 on spot would be amazing because I am thinking about bringing him up, bringing him up to rank five. But let's awaken uh, Miles Morales. Um, he was one of my first champions that went up to rank three to make me Paragon. So why not awaken him now? All right, second crystal. We're still looking for a new champion, and we're still looking. All right. I mean, there's some decent champions in here. There really is. It's not that bad at all. Um, might go with Red Hook on this one. Yep, let's go with Red Hook. Red Hulk. And just add 26 to him. Bringing him up to level 40. All right. So we're still looking for a brand new champion. Here comes... Kabam. Disconnecting... Kabam really has to do a better job of that. <clears throat> I believe they have admitted that there is an issue, but it really hasn't been fixed. And this, I know it's not my internet connection, because this happens wherever I go with this. I just get disconnected. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I know it's not the... It's not everybody's internet. So Kabam just has to do a better job with this. Um, you guys make a lot of money. You guys have to fix this. I mean, that's... The most annoying thing about a game is just having bugs and these issues that we really should not be having. I mean, most games do not have this. So they just got to do a better job. Just look in the mirror and say, you know what? We got to fix this. Hopefully we got... Oh, yeah, we do. We still have both crystals. So let's get going with um, the crystal number three. Maybe uh, the reward is for, the, for this. And... Oh... Oh, oh, there we go, guys. As you guys see in window number one, one of the champions I was going for, and I, he actually has eluded my account all this time, but we finally got Quicksilver. Finally got a banger. There we go, guys. That's a great one. All right, here comes the last crystal. Let's see who we get. Wow. Wow. We get to awaken him, and he also popped in window number one again. I guess Kabam knocked me out of the internet so they could reset it, so they can give me Quicksilver. You know what? I'm all right with that. If you're going to reward me like that, you can kick me off a little more often. Not too much, but a little bit more. All right, guys, look at that view right there. Back-to-back -back Quicksilvers. Very nice, getting him brand new, and then awakening him, and bringing us even more closer to four seven-star crystals that we want to open. We do have a couple of more videos, guys, that are going to be coming up soon. I have a thousand gold that I want to open up. I got those rank four to five crystals that I want to open up. I got some six-star crystals that I want to open up, and eventually the seven stars. All right, guys. Um, so overall. Not too bad at all. Could have been a little bit better, but I ain't arguing with a couple of awakenings and adding Quicksilver finally. So if you like what you saw, please press that like button, subscribe to my channel, 
Don't forget to click on the notification bell so you can get notified when I upload a new video.